Meghan Markle has cemented her place in the British royal family. The Duchess of Sussex is due to give birth in a matter of weeks and her child will be seventh in line to the throne. But what was Meghan like before the royal wedding? Before she married Prince Harry, actress Meghan Markle was best known for her role in legal drama suits. She starred in flop crime drama Andy Social with British actor Greg Salkin before her romance with Prince Harry had even begun. And now Greg, who played Meghan's graffiti artist boyfriend in the series, has spilled the beans on what she was really like. London-born Greg Salkin, 26, worked with the Duchess of Sussex on Andy Social in 2015, Meghan's last role before retiring from acting. Speaking in an interview on Fair Game with Christine Leahy, he heaped praise on Meghan, saying she was a princess before she ever joined the royal family. He said, everybody does know her as a princess, but in real life, she genuinely is also like a princess. She is one of the classiest, the nicest, one of the most sincere and genuine people I've ever met. The British actor said he was proud of Meghan, 37, for sticking to her guns and for dealing well with media scrutiny, adding, she was a superstar. To me, I'm so proud of the fact that she's part of my country's history in all honesty, aside from obviously having a personal relationship with her. I just think the way she's handling it, obviously the press of you know, it hasn't been easy for her. And she's stuck to her guns, which is, you know, when they go low, we go high sort of mentality and I think she's done that. I think she's been a class act. Meghan played the female lead in crime drama Antisocial, which was set in London and revolved around a graffiti artist, Mr. Sulkin, who helps his armed robber brother in a gang rivalry. It was slammed by critics and received a 25% rating on Rotten Tomatoes. Mr. Sulkin is perhaps best known for his appearances in the Disney Channel programs as The Bell Rings and Wizards of Waverly Place, starring Selena Gomez. Meghan, who is heavily pregnant, is due to give birth in April, and it's expected she'll have a home birth. Meghan and Harry visited a West London school this week, where Harry jokingly mimicked her baby bump. While the royal baby-to-be's gender is being kept a secret, there's much speculation around what it could be named. Diana remains the bookie's favorite name, if the baby is a girl. But Gertrude and Marmaduke could both be in the running too.